Good evening everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Meh, episode 10 I believe it is, I believe it's number 10. Um, it's been a little while since we visited up this game, which is, you know, I was, I was looking back at some of the old footage that we did of this and uh, I think, in hindsight, sometimes I've been a little bit unfair in this game. It has shown us some pretty neat things on rare occasions. I'm not just saying that because now we can zoom around at fucking light speed. That is a plus though. <laughs> it has to be said. Um, let's go Let's go into Turd World. This is not Turd World, it's obviously some kind of coral of corals. If you will. A coral ral. Um, it's fucking hot here at the moment. I have had to take extensive measures both to to keep my soundproofing in place and to um, let's, let's touch this and to not just overheat so we've been here before on this little starry street and we can talk to this thing let's take this here god it's so hot you guys it's like I think the universe knows that I'm sitting down to try and do some let's plays and it's like don't know no, no, what you're going to do is you're going to stand, you're going to sweat all over the place. So we went left last time. Down here. We're not going to do that. Not today, anyway. Because what's the point of doing that? We already did it. We don't need to redo content, which there's a there's a distinct chance that might be what this descends into, because for some reason... I think it's because a lot of the areas in this game seem to be... Deep rather than broad. Don't you? Do you ever think that you would actually really kill yourself? <sighs> well, hmm. not today. Not unless it gets hotter. Then I might be thinking about it. Because the the the, the areas in the game are. Ah, uh, the game is like locked up for a second there when I was trying to load the noise of the door opening. Um. Tenho sedades do me primo. If I told you the truth, you wouldn't believe me. Okay, well, let's not go up there just yet. Just yet. It's a long day. We've got a long day ahead of us. We've got some cars to speed on past. Um, what was I saying? Weave. We weren't saying weave. No, sir. Um, where is that? Thing. Hello there, Mr. Handy. Hello to you again. It does not surprise me to find you here find you again. I know you're different than the others. They all ran, but you kept. Now, you see how much you feel like. Maybe here, maybe there, maybe on another place. Why can't I be more clear? Because I want you to grow. And in this case, the best way to grow up is to find the answer by yourself. Of course you may or may not find it. But what matters in this case is what you had learned. That's why I'm here, located in this deserted metropolis. I was just passing by. Do not worry about me. I am already an adult monster and I can fend for myself very well. Besides, you should read the text on the walls. Even though they're the byproduct of illegal activities, they have interesting phrases. I kind of feel like I'm an adult monster myself. Maybe less like that guy and more like, um thingy. Sully from Monsters, Inc. Maybe. Silencio, silencio, silencio. Some of these faces just make me smile. This one here. Um, okay, we're getting distracted though. Which you don't want to do. We're supposed to be on, on mission here. But anyway, I was talking about um, the areas in this game seem to be kind of deep as opposed to broad, like in, in Tukey, you end up crossing through the same area about a bloody million times to the point that you just get fed up with it. Like going backwards and forwards through that corridor in the hospital, going through the fucking red streetlight world, all that shit. You just do it over and over again, and as a result, the areas, you kind of become familiar with them, but in this, I mean, bear in mind, we've probably got like, I don't know, two hours worth of gameplay. Fucking, I don't know where the fuck anything is, and if we come across the same thing again, I could probably 
cleared by how frequently we're playing it. I wouldn't catch it. It's very likely we're going to start stumbling over the same thing over and over again. Which then means we need to do a little bit of recon before we dive too far into our adventures. Which is, is fine, I, I, don't, I don't mind doing that. I said when it's bastard and hot. Fucking can see you, Jimmy. Where's this fucking thing? I don't know what the the globules that are flying around are. Well, they're, they're globules. That's what they are. Globules. Globule is as globule does. This is what we want, I think. While we have that, I'm gonna have a swig of my coffee. Mmm. Drinking a nice cold coffee. And rather a boiling hot coffee on a warm day. Uh, let's go in here. I'm trying to record this at higher FPS because I noticed that sometimes the FPS and my thing looks a bit kind of shit. You have nowhere to go because your heart will keep on it forever, ever, ever, ever. When will anyone stop scribbling on the walls when you do vivid? Vividive. Vividive. What are you saying, Vividive? Is this Vividive? This little character here? No. Vividive is the red writing. Red writing hood. Red writing hood. I should say. Oh, it's dark and spooky in here. Could you imagine having to go up to the wings? What? What is that? See, I wonder what that was before. It kind of looks almost like auditorium seating. I don't think that's what it's supposed to be there. Hey, what you saying there, buddy Well, Why did you do that? What did you do exactly? Did you jump off? You are like a bird. Why did you not tell me? You have no idea. I can't even read that last bit. Who left that box of junk there? Oh, is that the, the guy that jumped off? Oh. Get out of there. The vent over. Vent over, everyone. You can come out from behind the bed. The vent's over. We're not over. <laughs> I'm happy to continue mugging this shit. For at least a little while longer. Because there's something else we want to check. I guess that was kind of neat. I, I like that there's a bit more. Maybe it's because it's in English. Some of it anyway. anyway that there's some direct meaning to it. But I mean, even though I don't think that's true because in fucking Tuki and Flow, a lot of it is deliberately kind of ambiguous and symbolic. This seems less like that, it's more going for like hard, like bam, this is what this is what this is supposed to be. I do kinda like that. Kinda. As long as it's not beating you about the head with it. That's fine. I'm amazed I haven't started coughing. Because I'm really sick at the moment. Don't know if it sounds like that. I, I, I feel like shit. I feel absolutely rotten. Uh, I had big plans for this weekend and uh, they all fell through. The letters are unreadable. I can read it from here, it's like a big circle. Can we say the logo of this game, maybe? Maybe, I don't know. I need to look at the logo for this game again to be sure. Possibly. Well, a little, a little eyelet corridor. Very nice. Very uh, pleasant. Is that a tumour or has it just like got a moon growing out the side of here? What's the rope? Can we grab that? No. As people have said before, there's a, there's a kind of strange disparity in the art style in this and some of the environments do look really nice. Like that was particularly well rendered, the bit we were just in. That's a cool effect, I like that. So I guess the theme of this episode is uh, epi epi epitode episode is uh, writing on the wall. 
things we never had. I guess we never had. Uh, what is that? Those little machines used for scanning barcodes and hands. Yeah, they do have the right number of fingers. Look like it didn't for a second there. Oh wow, that's a loud noise. Well, wow, aren't you excited? Somebody nail that cupboard down, it's out of control. Hold on a second, before we get too lost, because this looks like the kind of area that is gonna have this effect, right? So we came in through that corded door there. It's like bits of a tile set flying around all crazy like. Where are they going? Where is their ultimate, oh, come back here bed. Ah. Okay. Things we never had. Eggs on our bedside tables. Hmm. It's got a strange ambiance in here. Like something's about to happen. Is it going to be a bed flying through the air? Because if it is, that's not that spooky. I just saw that. I just saw my bed get halved up. And then get spit through the air. The world! A miniature of what? <laughs> Some of these remarks are just so silly. A miniature of what? It's a figure of a cartoonish character. I've never even seen who it is. It's a diary and I won't read it. The owner might be nearby. <clears throat> yeah, maybe it's this little thing. Dream slug. Oh shit. Okay. Apparently that's a television. It's a television, everybody. And nothing on the television but bad news. We gotta, we gotta do it. We gotta do it. We gotta play with the bed, right? Can we do that? No. No. Okay, let's maybe try some some things here. Not that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Okay. What is that I'm looking at? Okay, good. So we'll, we'll figure something out. Apparently that was that was it. Yeah, that's great and everything, but I don't know what that is. No, 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 no. Okay, okay. Let's try this one more time. Yeah. Okay. Good. Good, now with that silly triangular thing. Triangle monster. Maybe I can make a, because I did circle challenge before. That's not gonna be my game, I swear. I'm not gonna do triangle monster as a sequel to circle challenge. No, so, uh, circle challenge is a game I made when I was at um, college. It's a hangman clone with some incredible art. Mouths, ahoy. I kind of didn't want to go away from that area. Can we go back? We can, okay, good. Okay, good. We're going to stay reasonably on focus. Because that's um, so I want to do it today. Problems? Sometimes absence of evidence doesn't mean evidence of absence, but sometimes it does. Okay. Sometimes, okay, can we do anything here? No. No, okay. Okay, I guess that's our, our bit then. Cool, well, I'm, I'm glad that I came all the way back to do that. 
Let's continue on anyway. Oh, makes some cider and coffee. Not not a good idea. Not a good idea. Not a pleasant combination of tastes. Hey, look, is that? What is that? It's like a little mouth, or it's like a little guy with a scary face. What's that guy there with the scary face? Oh, can we go up here? We can. Look at that. It's like a spring morning, all the little things are flying around all over the place. All these mouths are kind of gory. This one isn't, though. I'm just glad it's not eyes. How fucking refreshing is that? Things we never had. Mouths. There you go. Kind of stuttery there for some reason. Uh, why did that happen? I guess it must just be happening randomly. What's this thing? We haven't got very many effects, have we? Maybe we could get an effect out of this adventure. It does not work. Yeah, well... Fuck. We can fix it. No. No, we can't fix it. We're not qualified to, to fix anything. Rub it out. If it doesn't work, we don't need it. Okay, I thought maybe because of the background changed, maybe it would... Right, okay, I get it. Come on, just, just, just on your fucking wings, away you go. Good, so we've had a broken television. The most entertainment we've had in this game in a while. A broken television. It's a bit unfair, isn't it? A bit. It's a bit unfair. What about one of these gory masks? I guess the, the teeth have been pulled out. See, that really irks some people. Some people have, like, real fear of, uh, like, mouths and teeth. That one looks particularly scary and gruesome. Me, not so much. Teeth are just like, you know, it's like, you've got a mouthful of them. Just don't drink so much fizzy drinks. What's that over there? It's a cherry. Can we get that? No. No. No cherry for us. It is a cherry. Look, they're fucking cherries. The fuck are these cherries down? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Uh, what if we try orb? Aha, look at this. Check this out. Look at this thing. That's us if we were on a really bad day. Hello. would like to welcome everyone back to Let's Play Doom 2016. As you can see, we have emerged onto the Mars surface. Things look quite demonic, has to be said, but it's fine. We've got our, we've got our shotgun. We've got our weapons. There's some people hanging there. I don't know what that is in the background, the little dots. Uh, hey, what's, what's that? Wow, they're getting progressively more and more. What's the what's the phrase I'm looking for? Discombobulated. These ones don't even have people on them. Is there one for me? Wouldn't that be a turn out for the books? What you got to say there? Spirit. We got an effect, everybody. Spirit. Excellent. It looks around every which way, and that's all it does. Okay. What's going on up here? Trees. Good. Let's try. Um... Oh no! Now we're just a fucking creature of beauty. Holy shit!
Yeah, I know. Things are just getting worse and worse, aren't they? Okay, I'm bored looking up this fucking tree. Come on. Right, enough. Enough tree. Let's, let's um, can we go up this side of the tree? No. Okay. Okay, good. Good. So maybe we try using our new thing. I like how the effects make different noises. That's a nice touch. We're gonna try one thing. Since we're here. Okay, whatever that thing was, it is gone. It is fucking gone, everyone. It's gone, never to return. C'est la vie. So we are gonna be gone. Get ourselves the fuck out of this demonic landscape. Excuse me. Back to safety. <clears throat> no, shut up. Stop trying to do that. So, hmm, hmm, hmm. I suspect this area might well have shot its ward now. Yeah, yeah, hmm. Come on, go up the stairs. Past all these spindly broccolis. Oh man, I could eat some broccoli. Nice frozen broccoli. Oh, that would be nice. Nice cold. Mmm. Yeah, cold. Cold frozen broccoli. Right, okay, I'm, I'm happy that we've seen everything else today. And we got an effect out of it. Excellent. What a result. What a result, everybody. Um, gravy gravy. Well, episode. That's episode 10? I think it is. Maybe lying. Something like that. Uh, thanks for watching.